mistake. Hey everyone, today I wanna to show you a really cool little feature built into Google Docs that very few people know about and use, which is the Explore button. So once you've got your Google Doc open, all you need to do to open the Explore tab is to come down to the bottom right corner and click on this little icon that says Explore. Now I use Google Docs for years without even noticing this was here, but I promise when you find out about its features, you're going to use this regularly. So when I click Explore, I get a search box, and the first thing I do is punch in a search term. So I'm gonna type in puppy, and it searches my Google Drive for any document related to the word puppy, which is great if I wanna reference another document in this document. But what's even cooler is I have this link here that says web, which allows me to search the web for anything related to the word puppy. So what that allows me to do is one, I can click on a link and it will open the article in a new tab, or I can grab that link and drag it into my document. What's more, is I can actually press these little quotations right here and it will actually cite this article in a footnote in my document automatically. Super cool. In addition to that, I have an images link which will allow me to basically search Google images for any word right here within my document. So instead of having to open a new tab, go to Google images, search for the image, find the one I like, copy the link, paste it in, I can simply come over to my explore tab put in a search term, and when I find an image I like, I can simply grab the image and drag it into my document and then format, format it however I choose. So as you can see, with one click, you have access to the web, Google Images, and any other file that you have saved in Google Drive. So this makes it super easy to add anything from outside of your document to your document simply by clicking and dragging. Now I'm gonna do a bunch of other videos on great tips and tricks for Google Docs and other features of Google Drive, so definitely make sure you hit subscribe and check out my tech tips every weekday at noon and check out the other great content we release on our YouTube channel. And in addition, make sure you check out the DAE.com to check out our schedule of private lessons and workshops, and I look forward to seeing you tomorrow in my next tech tip.